The reflective writing assignments within the PID program are an important part of going deeper and making your learning your own. We know from the research and from our experience that when a student has the opportunity to write about something or talk about something or share what they've learned with others and reflect on those particular insights that it makes a significant difference in the learning process. And so we use this uh, aspect of critical and analytical thinking to help you go deeper with your learning. We use what is called a focused conversational method where you explore an objective, you reflect on that objective, you make an interpretation, and then you make a decision about what you're going to do about these ideas. You'll be asked to complete two assignments, two reflective writing entries, where you will, where you will use this four-step method. Uh, one of the entries will deal with the notion of the hidden curriculum, the explicit or implicit curriculum, and the second entry will deal with essential skills and employability. So you'll explore these ideas, you'll take a look at some resources, and you'll address um, these ideas from the uh, four uh, steps. And we encourage you to use those four headings within your writing. Uh, it's going to be important that you provide a cover sheet your, with your student name and your course name. This is all one document. The cover sheet shouldn't be separate. Uh, we're looking for an entry to 500 and 750 words or more. Uh, it's really up to you. And it's really important that if you, when you cite these ideas or cite these resources that you use the APA methodology. The first assignment is due in the second week of the course and the second assignment is, is due in the fifth week. Those two dates are, are important if you do want to receive feedback. Um, uh, the final due date for everything in the course is the last day of course where I uh, will accept assignments. But uh, if you can get the assignments in on the recommended due dates, I'm able to give you feedback that you can use to you know, continue to improve the work that you're doing. So we look forward to seeing um, how you take advantage of this uh, reflective opportunity to go deeper into your learning.